It's time for kickoff of BYU Women's Soccer on the new skin, BYU Sports Network. Cameron Tucker comes away with it, a shot and a goal! Cameron Tucker goes far post! Live play-by-play coverage is brought to you by Mountain America Credit Union, the official credit union of BYU Athletics. Also brought to you by Smith's Food and Drug. Smith's now has grocery pickup and online delivery to save you time. Now for today's call, here's Jason Shepard. BYU soccer fans, welcome into Stevens Stadium in Santa Clara, California, where this afternoon the 11th ranked BYU Cougars facing the reigning national champions, the 25th ranked Santa Clara Broncos. My name is Jason Shepard, joined by Rachel Manning Jorgensen. Thank you so much for tuning in to BYU women's soccer. Today is a massive matchup as it pertains to winning the WCC title. The Cougars sit atop the standings at 6 0, the only undefeated team in conference. The Broncos are again back at 5-1 and one after a loss last Saturday at Portland. A BYU win today puts the Cougars firmly in the driver's seat in terms of winning the West Coast Conference Championship. BYU beat Santa Clara at Stevens Stadium last season, technically still this year. The Cougars' first ever win over the Broncos in Santa Clara in program history. BYU looking to make it two in a row today. For more on tonight's matchup, let's... Uh, here from the head coach of the BYU Cougars, Jennifer Rockwood, our pregame interview brought to you by Zions Bank. For banking that helps you tackle every financial challenge, Zions Bank is for you. I don't know how much you guys focused on it before, but getting the win here a couple months ago, from a mental standpoint, does that change coming back here just a few months later? Well, I, I think, you know, we kind of had a chip on our shoulder last time, and, and you know, it's something that a BYU team had never done, so that was kind of the focus is to, to do something like that. But but now coming back here, we have, I think, more confidence coming in here. Um, we've had a great season. I think we're playing a lot better soccer, even than when we beat them last time. So it's a lot of expectation and a lot of excitement to be back against, you know, defending national champions, excited for what they were able to accomplish and something that we want to try and get to, to that point to have a chance to play for something like that. So this is a big step in that direction. One of the things this team specifically, and obviously the program has been known for, is its attack. Against a team like Santa Clara, that would seem to be a pretty big key. If you guys can do what you do, this could be a really good day. Oh, absolutely. I mean, Santa Clara is a very good attacking team uh, as well, but um, a lot of our attack is our defense and our defensive pressure. So we put the two together I mean, we can't we can't be a great attacking team without our defensive energy and working together as a team. And I think that's something that definitely has gotten better um, as we understand the girls understand their responsibilities and they and they work together as a team. But I mean, we'll definitely have our hands full. But so much to look forward to. We love these big games. End of the season, a lot riding on it. And um, yeah, just just looking forward to it. All right, that was head coach Jennifer Rockwood, and we are officially underway here at Stevens Stadium at Buckshaw Field. We'll get to the starting lineups momentarily. Foul has been called on BYU, so a free kick for the Santa Clara Broncos. Let's get to our starting lineups. Brought to you by Larry H. Miller. Larry H. Miller, auto-driven by you. Starting lineups for the BYU Cougars, the visitors from Provo. On the back line, it is number four, Grace Johnson and Lavinny Vaca. Your midfielders, Olivia Smith, as well as Brecken Mazingo, Michaela Coulihan, Jamie Shepard, Kendall Peterson, and Bella Felino. Your forwards up top are Cam Tucker, as well as McKaylee Moore. We will get to the starters for Santa Clara in just a moment as they started a little bit early here at Santa Clara. We weren't 100% sure exactly when first kick was going to be, so we knew we were going to be playing it by ear a little bit. But we're in the second minute here, just underway, and you know, Rachel, we had talked about this, uh, I mentioned it in the open, this is a, a big game for BYU, and certainly can do themselves a lot of favors with the win today in terms of uh, sewing up the WCC championship with two more after today. Right, it's a huge game for BYU. I think they've stepped onto the pitch today and been confident. They're uh, going into these 1v1 battles pretty hard, and they're doing a great job of you know, communicating right from the get-go. Santa Clara with possession in the far corner. Defended nicely by Jamie Shepard. Across through from Santa Clara. It goes all the way through. And kicked out of play by Bella Felino. 
It'll be a throw-in for the Broncos. It'll be Sally Menti throwing in. And it goes all the way through. A takeaway by the Cougars. Vaca sending it the other way. Michaela Coulihan now in the neutral third. And plays it wide to Olivia Smith. Cougars want to attack. You heard Coach Rockwood talking about that's the really the basis of everything they do, and it starts on the defensive end, but right now it has been Santa Clara that has had the majority of the possessions. Kick out of bounds off of the Broncos, a throw in, and Kendall Peterson will do it here on the near side. In fact, right next to the BYU bench. Throw in to Felino, back to Petey. Petey's pass taken away. Pass taken away by Kylie Halverson. And now to Menti. Menti defended by Vaca in the corner. Now a pass to number 10, Kelsey Turnbow. She is their dynamic player that you're going to want to pay attention to today. Kick out of play. It will be off of BYU. And Turnbow is walking gingerly towards the corner. Did not notice that she had anything happen to her on the run of play, but she's seems to be in a little bit of pain trying to walk. That's something certainly to take, uh, take notice of. And she will take the corner kick, our first corner of the ball game, and it'll be for Santa Clara and Kelsey Turnbow will be the one taking it with the left foot into the box and cleared by BYU and out of play. And it'll be another corner kick. And Turnbow will just stay right there. For a closer look at some of the players the Cougars will be covering tonight, it's brought to you by Intermountain Pool Covers, safety and quality you can depend on. Kelsey Turnbow is certainly that player. She leads this team in just about every offensive category. So she's somebody to pay attention to tonight and has the full attention of the BYU Cougars. Ball put into play, and right to Cassidy Smith. Smith with the first goal kick for BYU. But the Cougars cannot maintain possession. And now a bad pass will give BYU the ball. Here come the Cougars. Trying to split the double team, looking for Coulihan. BYU able to keep the ball, and now BYU looking to push forward. Brecken Mazingo on the far side. Finds Cameron Tucker. Cameron Tucker into the box. Near the end line. Nice defensive play there by number 22, Alexi Loera. Kicking it out of the end line. And so it will be a Mountain America Credit Union corner kick for the BYU Cougars. Mountain America Credit Union, the official credit union of BYU Athletics. Brecken Mazinga will take it in the far side. Mazingo runs up on it, right foot cross. And Santa Clara on the clear, can't get it past Olivia Smith. So BYU maintains possession. Smith splits the double team, loses the ball, it goes out the inline, but they'll say off of the Broncos. So another corner kick. This will now even up the corner kicks at two apiece. Mazingo will take this one again. I mentioned Kelsey Turnbow. She leads this team in goals with eight, assists with seven, points with 23, as well as shots and shots on goal. BYU obviously a dangerous team. That corner in the box cleared out by Santa Clara, but it's the BYU back line that will come away with it. Jason Shepard and Rachel Manning Jorgensen with you from Stevens Stadium here in Santa Clara, California. Cameron Tucker wide to Mazingo. Brecken now making her move. A shot from deep and a nice save by the keeper, Kylie Fouch. Fouch uh, from Lake Stevens, Washington, a 5'9 sophomore. And so it'll be the third corner kick of the afternoon for the BYU Cougars, brought to you by Mountain America Credit Union. Mazingo with the right foot into the box. Somewhat of a half bicycle kick there by McKaylee Moore. 
and it goes wide of the far post. So it'll be a goal kick for Kylie Fouch. Let's get to the rest of the starting lineup for the Santa Clara Broncos. As we mentioned, number zero, Kylie Fouch in goal. Defenders, uh, number two, Eden White, as well as Marissa Bubbins and Emma Reeves. The forwards, number nine, Dequil Izzy Dequilla, Kelsey Turnbow, and Kylie Halverson. Your midfielders, Skylar Smith, Ellie Glenn, Alex Loera, and Sally Menti. Those are your starting lineups for both BYU and Santa Clara. Ball up for grabs. And it gets through and rolls all the way into the box. Cassidy Smith moving right up to the edge and jumps on it. But you had Izzy Dequilla on the move looking for a one-on-one -on -one situation. BYU possession. Knocked out of play by Santa Clara and a throw in now. And it should be Kendall Peterson right in front of the BYU bench here on the near side. Putting the ball in play. She finds Bella Felino, And now back to Petey. Kendall with a pass back to Vaca. And now to Grace Johnson. Grace now pushing the ball forward. Coulihan can't hang on to the pass. Here come the Broncos. Marissa Bubbins. Sends it back to the Bronco back line, right at midfield. And a nice defensive play by Jamie Shepard. Took away the passing lane and forces a turnover for the Broncos. So, BYU. Both teams with two shots, each team with a shot on goal. But so far, nothing serious in terms of scoring opportunities for either side. But we're in the 10th minute here. And I love the fact, Rachel, that the clock is counting up. Love it. I don't have to do math going the other direction. It makes it, makes it a little bit helpful. It makes it a lot more helpful. <laughs> Out of play off of BYU, throw in on the far side for Santa Clara. Into Turnbow. Turnbow spins away from the defense, can't do it. Smith. Nice defensive play, BYU ball. And McKaylee Moore has it, right on the edge of the attacking third. Now plays it back to Peterson. Kendall, looking for Tucker, but really good defense by the Broncos to take away the passing lane. As they clear though, BYU comes away with it. A shot deep from Peterson with the left foot is wide of the far post, and it'll be a goal kick for Fouch. BYU's had a couple of corners, but other than that, really the, the shots that the Cougars have had really haven't had much chance of going in. So we mentioned BYU the only undefeated team in the West Coast Conference. They are 6-0 and in conference play. One game back is the Broncos at 5-1 and after a surprising loss at Portland. Broncos lost 2-0. That obviously opens the door. BYU can win this one today. Go a long way towards a conference championship. But work to do here and for the rest of the season. Two more regular season games after today. BYU possession. Grace Johnson on the back line. Passes to Shepard. Jamie has the ball taken away. Turnbow with possession. Turnbow not paying attention. And Coulihan comes from behind and takes it away. BYU ball. Shepard right at midfield. Jamie to Coulihan and a one-touch back to Jamie. Jamie on the move. Nobody's getting in front of her. Oh, the pass through for McKaylee Moore taken away. Good defense by the Broncos. Had that pass been able to get through, McKaylee Moore would have been 1v1 versus Fouch. Kicked out of play by Santa Clara. It will be BYU ball. And Kendall Peterson will throw in right in front of the Bronco bench. Santa Clara, number 25, BYU, number 11. And two coaches who've been with their programs for a very long time. Jerry Smith, year 35. Jen Rockwood, year 27. Institutions at their programs for sure. Ball put in play, BYU ball. Lavini Vaca has it on the back line. Now plays to Johnson. P. 
Peterson dribbling towards the middle of the pitch. And the Broncos will come away with it. But that was short-lived. BYU's defense jumping back into the frame, taking it away. Here comes Cameron Tucker. Nice sliding play by Fouch, moving up. Takes away the shot. Cam Tucker just could not get the shot off. The defense, she had the defender on her hip, and then Fouch pulling up. The ball knocked out of play, and it'll be another Mountain America Credit Union corner kick for BYU, and specifically Brecken Mazingo. Mountain America Credit Union, the official credit union of BYU Athletics. Brecken plays in to Smith. Now back to Brecken, and a shot from the corner hits the far post and ricochets back. Boy, that was inches from being BYU on top, 1-0. The good news is Cougars still have possession. Across, into the box, headed up by Felino, and that hits the other post. That's two shots that have hit both posts. BYU had possession, and now it's taken away by the Broncos. Oh, my goodness. One shot to the far post, ricochets back. One shot to the near post, and it hit it. BYU, though, making things happen here, and we've seen this time and time again. When the Cougars get looks like that, eventually they're going to get one or four of those to go down. Mazingo on the run, taken down outside the box. It'll be a foul on Santa Clara. So a free kick for the BYU Cougars. And this is a free kick that is about a foot to maybe foot and a half outside of the box. Wilner and O'Reilly, a proud sponsor of BYU Soccer. Immigration Solutions in Utah and abroad at wilneroreilly.com. Mazingo will take the free kick. She was the one that was fouled. Waiting for the whistle to blow for play to resume here in the 15th minute from Santa Clara. We are scoreless. BYU and Santa Clara, a matchup of two top 25 teams. Mazingo runs up on it. The pass to Smith and now back to Brecken. Brecken. Somewhat of a cross and shot, but it floated right into the arms of Fouch. And an offensive possession ends up in the hands of the Bronco keeper. BYU inches away from being up 1-0 in this ball game. Bronco ball taken away by the Cougars. Cameron Tucker with the ball. Pass to Shepard, top of the arc. Jamie. Cuts to her right, shot with the right foot, sails over the crossbar, and a goal kick coming for Fouch. Well, really, Rachel, for the last five minutes, BYU has spent the entire time in the attacking third. That typically bodes well for a final score for BYU. Yeah, and when BYU is unfortunate to lose the ball, they, they press hard, and they're able to get that ball back in transition play. And... They've had a good string of possession up top, and one of the great plays was, was when McKaylee got the ball. She flicked it onto Cam and led Cam into space, and that led to a couple corner corner kicks and a couple shots too. So it's a great job by McKaylee to recognize that space. And you know, Brecken had some great shots over there and crosses. They're doing a great job up top. Yeah, BYU out shooting the Broncos six to two, and they've taken four corners to just two for the Broncos. Cougar possession, Moore in the corner with a pass to Coulihan. Can she save it from the end line? She cannot. Out of play, goal kick forthcoming for the Broncos. BYU in the All Royals. Santa Clara in the Home Whites, trimmed in maroon. A big matchup for both teams. Steal by BYU right at midfield. Peterson to Coulihan, and a quick pass to Jamie Shepard. Jamie directing traffic and then plays wide to Smith. Smith cuts back towards the middle of the pitch. Looks like she may have tripped on the grass. Got her foot caught on the ground and lost possession. Vaca, nice defense to take the ball away. Kylie Halverson was looking for a foul, did not get it. Thought she was taken down. Referee says play on, and it's BYU possession. Halverson was on the move, and great defensive play by Vaca. Pass forward, cleared. 
And out of play by Santa Clara. So right at midfield, BYU with a throw in. Peterson into Moore. And off of BYU and out of play. Marissa Bubnis, the sophomore out of Carlsbad, California, will throw in. And finds Turnbow. Turnbow, a long pass to the sideline. And now into the corner. Good defense. Skyler Smith was on the move in the... In the far corner, it's defended nicely by Olivia Smith, kicked out of play. So it should be a corner kick, which will even up the corners. Or excuse me, that will still give BYU a lead. It's, it will be 4-3. to three. This will be the third corner for the Broncos this afternoon. Pretty decent crowd here for the afternoon. And why wouldn't you be able to see two top 25 teams? Ball put in play. A shot by the Broncos, sent the other way by the BYU defense. Tucker comes away with it. Tucker on the move, outrunning two defenders. One defender to get past. A pass through looking for Bella Foligno. Nice defense, however, by Eden White, but BYU still comes away with it. Coulihan now with the ball in the box. A pass to Foligno, back to Coulihan. And now Coulihan has it taken away by Turnbow. Turnbow tries to save it before it goes out of play. She cannot do it, so a throw in on the far side by the BYU Cougars. Smith wastes no time, gets it into Mazingo. Brecken to Shepard. Jamie to the near side to Peterson. A shot with the left foot, hits off the crossbar and bounces up and over. So Rachel, we've had both post hit and the crossbar hit by BYU. The next one obviously means it's going in the net, right? You would hope so. It's a, it's, a, it's a good sign, too, that BYU has a shooter's mentality when they're getting you know close to the box. That shot looked great. It looked on frame. It just kept sailing and hitting the crossbar. Santa Clara loses the ball. Now it'll be a... punt from Cassidy Smith and a BYU possession. And they've already reached the attacking third. Cameron Tucker with a shot. Saved by Fouch. Got right in front of the shot. And now Santa Clara trying to clear it. They do. But on the pass, taken away by Jamie Shepard. So BYU right at midfield. 0-0 zero, zero, scoreless tie here. In the 21st minute, but BYU has had three looks. One has hit the far post, one hit the near post, and then one hit the crossbar. Right-footed cross, right to Fouch. Off of the foot of Olivia Smith. And Fouch ends that offensive opportunity for BYU. Fillmore Spencer is Utah Valley's largest top-rated local law firm. They can play offense, defense, or provide a little coaching. Fillmore Spencer, solving problems and seizing opportunities for you, your family, and your business. Ball put in play by the Broncos, but it's the Cougars who will come away with it. McKaylee Moore misplayed a pass, and it actually bounced up and hit her on the hand. It'll be a handball. So free kick deep in Santa Clara's defensive third. Molson in play. Both teams fighting for it, it was up for grabs. Cougars come away with it, Mazingo right in the center circle. Dribbling out of traffic. Pass to Peterson. Petey, some miscommunication with McKaylee Moore. The pass went to McKaylee's right. Moore went to her left. And a turnover for the BYU Cougars. Daquila with possession for the Broncos. 
up to Halverson. The ball played forward to Dequilla, but nice defense by the Cougars, taken away by Smith. Grace Johnson has the ball, almost loses it, regains her footing, and sends it forward. Here comes Coulihan. Wide to Felino. Bella plays wider to a streaking Peterson. Peterson down the near side, left foot across, hits off the defender. That was Bubness and out of play. Should be another corner kick coming for the BYU Cougars. This will be corner number five, and it is brought to you by Mountain America Credit Union, the official credit union of BYU Athletics. Going to have our first Zions Bank substitution as well. McKaylee Moore will check out. Rachel McCarthy will check in. Also, Olivia Wade checks in. And Bella Felino will check out. So after checking in, Olivia Wade immediately runs to the corner and will take the corner kick. On the near side in the BYU attacking third. Wade runs up on it. Across into the box. Coulihan got a head on it. Actually, it was Grace Johnson that got a head on it. And we've seen that combination of Wade to Johnson end up with goals that time right at Fouch. Defended nicely 10, by Wade. the Broncos. In for number 22, Bella Felino. So it is the possession of the Broncos, the home team. Three, Ellie Glenn plays wide. And now looking for Halverson. Kylie Halverson and Grace Johnson. Halverson gets ahead of the defender. Right foot across, cleared by Vaca and out of play. Corner kick coming for the Broncos. Coming up at halftime, you'll hear my conversation with Cam Tucker. It was her goal when BYU played here in March that turned out to be the game winner and gave BYU its first ever victory here at Santa Clara. So you'll hear our conversation coming up at halftime. Our player feature on Cam Tucker. Waiting for the corner kick. And it will be Kylie Halverson, the senior out of Hawaii, that will take the corner. Right foot across, headed out by Smith but not far enough. Shot taken in the box, but nowhere near the intended target out of play. It'll be a goal kick for Cassidy Smith. Smith rolls it back into play to Vaca. Vaca to Wade. Olivia dribbles out of the double team. Pass to Shepard. Now Jamie wide to Smith. Olivia, nice footwork. Gets away from the defender. Now outrunning two defenders. Her pass for Tucker taken away. I'd say Santa Clara has done a really nice job of playing the lanes and not giving BYU the angles for some of the passes that we're used to seeing. Done a nice job defensively. Santa Clara coming away with it. Turnbow. Can't hang on to it. BYU possession. Wade with the ball to Peterson. And now to Shepard. Jamie wide. Mazingo up top to McCarthy. Rachel checking in moments ago. McCarthy stops and starts. Cuts back to her left. A pass to Coulihan right at the top of the arc. A shot by Coulihan. Couldn't get enough on it. Two defenders in front of her. Bounces out of play, and it will be BYU possession. A throw in, deep in the attacking third for Rachel McCarthy. She's got one of the best throws. On display again, into the box, skips off the head of a BYU and Santa Clara player, and it's BYU possession right in the neutral third. Smith with the ball. Shepard to Peterson. Kendall finding McCarthy. McCarthy stumbles a little bit, regains her footing. A pass to Peterson, but defended nicely by the Broncos. 
That was Lucy Mitchell with some nice defense. It hit off of her and out of play. Another Mountain America Credit Union corner kick coming up, and Olivia Wade will take it. Cougars setting up in the box. BYU very dangerous off corners. This is corner number five for BYU. Wade with the right foot. Sends it into the box. Cleared out by the Broncos, but Coulihan catches up to the ball. Coulihan has two defenders around her trying to dribble out of congestion. Cannot do it. In fact, I think she thought the ball rolled out of play. It did not. Santa Clara with a takeaway. And here come the Broncos. We are scoreless in the 29th minute. And the defense for BYU stifling. They'll play it all the way back into the box. And Fouch is taken down. Rachel McCarthy ran into Fouch. And now Fouch is slow to get up. And the referee is talking to Rachel McCarthy. And she's having a no card has been issued, but she did run into Fouch in the box. No, no card is going to be given, but she was just talked to. And now the referee is going to go talk with Fouch, who's getting an explanation. And she's trying to plead her case that it should have been a foul on McCarthy, but to no avail. My guess is they're saying both players had the right to the ball and just collided at the same time. So, Fouch places the ball down, steps back, and runs up on it with the left foot, puts it in play right into the center circle. And BYU comes away with it. Nice steal by the Cougars. Coulihan has her pass dislodged before she can make it. The ball rolling wide and caught up to by Mazingo. Mazingo with the pass to Smith. Cougars keeping it on the back line for the moment. Now Vaca finds Peterson in the far corner. Left footed cross goes all the way through. Sent the other way by the Bronco defense, but Jamie Shepard there to collect for the BYU Cougars. Mazingo, her pass slowed down, it hit the referee, and that actually helped the Broncos, kept it from getting to its intended target. Santa Clara will come away with it. Nope, and now a stoppage of play. They may have called a handball. Referee has picked it up, and it will be BYU possession. About 30 yards out, And Santa Clara comes away with it. A pass downfield, the only player there wearing BYU Royal Blue, and it's Grace Johnson. Grace, long pass to McCarthy. Couldn't get to it, but Coulihan does. And now, a pass back to Smith, right at midfield. And now the Cougars advance to Mazingo. Stop and start for Brecken. A pass to Tucker, it's off her head, ricochets out of play, goal kick coming for Fouch. Now another Zions Bank substitution, Ellie Mann will be checking in for Brecken Mazingo for banking that helps you tackle every financial challenge. Zions Bank is for you. Mazingo making her way to the BYU bench. So the Cougars with three substitutions so far here in the first half. McCarthy, Wade, and now Mon, the three subs. Play has resumed. And here come the Broncos. Ball on the near side. A pass for Mitchell. Just too far out of reach for her to catch up. Quick throw in for BYU. And it hits off of Olivia Wade. She tried to head it back in. Skipped off her head and fell out of play. But then the Broncos turn it over on their throw in. And BYU comes away with it, so no harm, no foul. Cougar possession. Still scoreless here in the 32nd minute. BYU's had opportunities. Missed it by inches. Smith near the inline. Across, right to Fouch on a one-hop save. Nicely done by Kylie Fouch.
If you're just joining the broadcast, BYU has had shots that have hit both posts and the crossbar. So the Cougars have missed opportunities literally by inches to be leading this game right now. The ball open for grabs and Cougars come away with it. Lands at the feet of McCarthy. One touch to Coulihan and then a pass to Cameron Tucker. But the defense for the Broncos stifling and a foul will be called on BYU. Free kick for the Broncos here. Deep in their defensive third. It'll be number two, Alex Loera taking the free kick. The ball sent wide to Eden White, the senior out of Portland. A deep pass. Both teams going for the ball that was bouncing around, and I believe they're going to call a foul on Jamie Shepard. It was Shepard and Mitchell that both went up for the ball, and they're going to call Jamie for the foul. So a free kick for Santa Clara in the neutral third. It appears that Loera will be the one taking the free kick. Loera and Reeves are back, and it will be Loera. A pass into the box, one hops right into the hands of Cassidy Smith. So a reset for BYU. 34th minute. We are scoreless here in Santa Clara. Ball put in play, and Santa Clara comes away with it. Santa Clara with the ball looking to reset. They're going to play it back to the back line to Karen Gore. Gore checked in momentarily. She saves it from going out of play to Mitchell. And now back to Gore. Gore crossing midfield. Good defense by Wade. She slipped. Otherwise, she would have had the steal. But backing her up was her teammate, Kendall Peterson, that comes away with the ball. BYU possession. Santa Clara showing press right now. The offside flag goes up. A play was being set up. They were looking to get the ball to Cameron Tucker. They got it, but the offside flag went up before she could make a move. So free kick for Santa Clara. Loera, the redshirt senior out of Thornton, Colorado, will take the free kick. Boots it deep. The ball bouncing around. And it will be Santa Clara that comes away with it. In the attacking third, a shot defeated nicely by Vaca. Bounces off of Lava. And the Cougars turning it the other way. Olivia Wade with the ball. Cutting to the middle of the pitch. To Coulihan. And now a quick pass to Shepard. Jamie looking for the cutters. Finds Coulihan. Passes out of the double team. Back to Shepard. Good defense by Santa Clara, and the defender goes down, and that's going to be another foul on Jamie Shepard, and I believe that the player that went down was Marika Gway. Jamie doesn't argue it and immediately runs the other way, so another free kick for the Broncos. Loera will take it again. Loera finding Halverson. And the ball right at midfield for the Broncos. Wide. For number two, White. Santa Clara having a hard time sending the ball forward. There's a deep pass into the box. Dangerous because you had Kylie Halverson on the move. Cassidy Smith timed it perfectly to be able to run and grab it before Halverson had an opportunity for a shot on goal. Nicely done by the Cougar keeper. Cass rolls it back into play. BYU ball. 37th minute of play here in Santa Clara. We are scoreless. Jason Shepard and Rachel Manning Jorgensen with you. BYU ball. As Coulihan almost lost it, regains it, and now passes to Tucker. Cam to Jamie Shepard and now to Mon. Mon cuts back, tries to pass through the double team, finds a way to do it to McCarthy, and now Rachel back to Jamie Shepard so the Cougars can reset. A shot 
or excuse me, a pass to Coulihan and a shot from deep sails wide and a goal kick coming for Fouch. We'll have another substitution brought to you by Zions Bank. For banking that helps you tackle every financial challenge, Zions Bank is for you. Cameron Tucker is going to check out and Caroline Stringfellow will check in, the freshman making her first appearance in the ballgame today. You hear the whistle. Fouch kicks the ball into play. Finds Karen Gour, a junior from Israel. Santa Clara possession. Halverson falls over Vaca. Almost did a flip. In fact, she did. She did a somersault and a takeaway by BYU. BYU right now just trying to find some sort of open lane. The defense right now for Santa Clara just not allowing a lot for BYU to do, even though the Cougars have had opportunities. Santa Clara possession. On the far side, a pass intended for DeQuilla. The Cougars with a nice takeaway. Grace Johnson kicks the ball the other way and it slices out of play. So a throw in for the Broncos on the far side is Eden White. Puts the ball in play. Right to BYU. Rachel McCarthy. Can't keep the ball. Turnover for BYU. But now the Cougars jump back in with the steal. In the neutral third. The ball played to the near side to Kendall Peterson. Pass into the box. Headed out the other direction. Nice defense there by Turnbow. The ball was in the air, foul called on the Cougars. So a free kick deep in the Bronco defensive third. The ball put in play. Both teams fighting for it and it'll be Santa Clara with an opportunity and some room to move. They find Colby Barnett. Barnett with a pass back to White. And now to Barnett. A little heel pass. And now a cross into the box, headed up and out of play by Santa Clara. It was a nice cross. But it ricocheted off of the head of Kylie Halverson and didn't go near the goal. It actually went the opposite direction, so it really had no chance of going in. But the cross was placed perfectly, so a goal kick for Cassidy Smith. She puts it in play, and Mon has the ball. Ellie to Smith. Olivia pushed in the back, does not fall down. Keeps her balance and keeps possession. Pass to Mon. Looking for Coulihan. Taken away by the Broncos. Pass into the box. And Halverson was there. Her shot hit off of the defender. And BYU's pleading its case. They're going to give Santa Clara a corner kick. I think BYU is asking for a foul on Halverson. But the referee says it's going to be a corner. Ball put in play, not a cross. A shot from deep hits off of Vaca and out of play. Another corner kick coming for the Broncos. Once again, it will be Kylie Halverson that will take the corner. Halverson this time, the cross into the box. Headed up by Alex Loera. It hit straight up in the air. An easy grab for Cassidy Smith. Cass puts it, the ball back in play for the Cougars. Pass intended for Peterson. Taken away by the Broncos. Loera with the ball. Pass deep to Dequilla. Dequilla shot with the left foot right into the waiting arms of Smith.
BYU wasting no time. We're in the 42nd minute, so the first half almost over. Still waiting for the first goal in this match. And the offside flag goes up. Dequila had broken away from Grace Johnson, but she was offside. That most certainly would have at least been a shot on goal. So it will be BYU possession with just under three minutes to go here in the first 45. Johnson set to take the free kick. Everybody getting downfield. Johnson with a nice kick into the attacking third. Santa Clara had it for a moment. We're looking to clear the ball down the other side and BYU right there to take it. So can BYU get something going? Not on that possession. Defended nicely by the Broncos. They'll kick it the other way and out of play. So the Cougars will get to reset with roughly two minutes to go here in the first half. A throw in by Smith to Johnson. A pass to Vaca and now even wider here on the near side to Peterson. Kendall with a pass to Wade and now to Jamie Shepard. Jamie with the ball. Finds Petey. Petey trying to get around Gore. Cannot do it. Gore kicks it out of play. Throw in for Peterson and the Cougars. BYU ball. Shepard with a pass to Peterson. Into the box. Headed the other way by the Broncos. And now the Broncos clear it. And another throw in on the far side for BYU. Nearing a minute to go here in half number one. You heard the whistle. Olivia Smith waiting for the signal that she can throw it and put it back in play. There was an, an injury, and it was to... Looks like we may have a bloody nose there to Guay. So they had to stop play so they could get the substitution in. That's what was holding up the play. BYU puts the ball in play and an opportunity with a minute to go. A shot from deep. Hits the side of the net. And from our vantage point, it actually looked like it may have gone in. I had to wait a second. There's a shot from Coulihan just outside the box but it hit the side of the net. So BYU has been so close on several shots today. It'll be a goal kick for Fouch, and I'm sure she's not going to hurry up and put this in play with 40 seconds to go in the first half. And she finally runs up on it, sends it deep right at midfield. It will be Santa Clara possession. Glenn with a pass downfield. Turned the other way by BYU. And with 15 seconds to go, barring something happening very quickly, we're going to go into half in a scoreless game here. And that's exactly what's going to happen. Both teams essentially just walking off the field. And after 45 minutes, 0-0 zero, zero in this battle of two top 25 teams. We will take a break. We'll hit some of the stats. Certainly won't be goals. We'll get you some of the stats, and we'll let you hear from Cam Tucker when we come back from Santa Clara. Number 11, BYU, zero. Number 25, Santa Clara, zero at half. We'll have Cougar Halftime Live coming up next on the new skin, BYU Sports Network. 